everyone, Marco here, the author of Terrain Mixer. Uh, I just want to show you something uh, that I decided to uh, build again or rebuild and that's the option for masking. Now if you remember uh, we used to have masks before uh, but it was kind of difficult to figure out what's going on. Uh, this is still not available in the uh, current uh, current version 1.9.2 uh, it will be in the next one uh, but uh, this will happen like really really soon in, in uh, two or three days so let me just show you what is it all about now first I want to mix uh, 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 the sliders a bit just to get something uh, interesting okay maybe like so we'll add the, the influence of the inputs uh, 3 and 4 by moving this C slider like so maybe even change the blending here and let's maybe try to stretch the input 3 a bit so we just have to look for the input 3 mirror Y3 like so okay let me just move it a bit here so it's like more pronounced okay and now we will go to the uh, terrain mixer uh, plus nodes workspace and we'll connect the ellipse mask uh, node group. So here you can. I I doubt that I'm gonna that I'm gonna add this to the uh, properties menu because it has like uh, four eight uh, sliders. So this is already pretty big. But you know if. Uh, you request it, uh, I will do it, but you know, I think it's pretty easy to go here to this uh, terrain mix plus nodes workspace and uh, do edit from there. So let's let's see what we have here. Uh, we can uh, shift the mask uh, on X and Y axis. So let me show you this. I'm holding shift while I'm shifting, uh, not because it starts with shift, but because uh, you can uh, uh, get fi finer incre increment uh, that way, so you can do it like this. Or maybe move it here a bit. Then you can scale it by X or uh, Y axis. I'm going to scale it on maybe X axis, like so. And maybe something like this okay I will rotate it a bit like so and shift it uh, on X exit a bit more towards here so I get this kind of dead end canyon at this point, uh, I think I'm gonna uh, change the way we preview the terrains by adding color and uh, snow. I like working like that. Okay, so here it is. Cool. And now I can adjust uh, depth also by holding shift like so uh, I can add a bit power to it and I can also soften the, the edges like so Okay, I think this looks nice. So 
So there you have it, uh, masking for terrain mixer. As you can see here, we have an image mask node as well, but I'll show you this uh, in one of the upcoming videos. So thanks a lot for uh, listening to my bad English and hope to talk soon. Cheers.